another thing we're highly inspired by is uh, the sounds of nature. The leaves between your uh, feet. The uh, birds. The wind through the leaves of the trees. The shape and symmetry of uh, plant life branching upwards towards the sunlight. The insects that buzz back and forth uh, in front of your face, whizzing uh, about their uh, lives. And uh, the patterns the grasses make when the wind blows on a hillside to uh, watching the plant breathe, watching the energy move in and out of organic life forms into each other. The quietness and stillness of everything happening all at once. It's not too many places left that you can uh, get away from the hustle and bustle of humans. I can hear freeways, sprinklers, dogs and children playing off in the distance somewhere in this song that's playing over the loudspeakers in the galaxy right now. Airplanes and beetles all happening all at once with a yucca plant pine trees cactus birds wind microphones cameras people headphones sticks radios no sprinklers, of course. Can't forget about the sprinklers. So really, uh, being tuned into the moment and uh, listening to the song that's always playing and you and I are always a part of. Listening just as much as uh, speaking and tuning, tuning into uh, the language of the birds, the rhythm of the trees, the song of the butterflies. song of photosynthesis, respiration, so those are a little bit of uh, the inspiration behind the music, listening to the music behind the scenes all the time in every moment. Everything doesn't always have to be flashing on screens to be interesting. Sometimes the subtleties and the quietness of being in a natural place around natural things can be an inspiration to keep you in spirit and in tune to the vibrations that are vibrating throughout the universe, always, infinite, moving upwards towards a higher potential, the dynamic tension of polarities battling towards reaching an infinite vibration 